Welcome back everyone. You may be in a situation where CarPlay isn't working for you. Now, if you're in this position, it's a typically a very easy fix. The first thing you wanna do is verify that your specific iPhone and the charging port at the bottom has a secure connection to your specific car. If it actually has a really bad connection, I would recommend plugging in your charger a couple more times in and out, seeing if it works and seeing if your specific you know, screen of your car recognizes it. Sometimes you have to make sure that your car even supports CarPlay because if it doesn't, then obviously there's going to be some issues. The next thing I would recommend doing is hopping inside of your settings app like this. You'll probably come into this panel and you want to go ahead and just type in CarPlay. Typically, if you type in car, that'll do it. And you can see we have the little CarPlay option here. So you want to go ahead and click on that CarPlay option. It'll take you right into here. Now, what's going to happen is it's going to go ahead and show you all the CarPlay cards that you have available. So what this means is you pretty much have to plug in your iPhone here and you should see your specific car come up right in the specific option area. If it doesn't come up, then that may mean that your car may be the issue. Possibly you also may have the charging port of your iPhone being the issue, but if it's a newer iPhone, you may not have the, you know, that specific problem. However, another issue that can happen is if the charger you're specifically using isn't a, an authentic iPhone charger, maybe it's not even a good iPhone charger and it's maybe possibly broken. So what I would recommend doing is using a different iPhone charger. However, if your specific iPhone is charging, so your iPhone is charging in the car, but you still don't see the available cars here and your car is not seeing your specific iPhone, then the other thing you can do is update your specific device. So what you wanna do is you wanna go ahead and update your specific iPhone. So you wanna come into your iPhone panel right here. You wanna scroll down into general, which is right here. And then you wanna go and click on software update. So what's going to happen is this specific device is going to go ahead and get an update. So you can go and click on the update panel. And most of the time at this point, you should be good to go. Once your iPhone actually boots back up, you want to try again, plug in your iPhone, see if that works. If nothing else is working, I'd recommend trying a different wire and even possibly trying a different car that has CarPlay enabled and see if your iPhone is able to connect via that way. Most of the time, that's the way to fix it, and that's what's pretty much fixed it for me, is typically plugging it in, plugging it back in, and that typically fixes it. So that's pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.